donuts, oysters, and tacos to barbecue and bacon on a stick. All of that deliciousness and more can be found in one place, Smorgasburg. I'm Lawrence Wyman, and I'm here to make sure you know all the inside info about New York City's greatest food and drink. And if your idea of weekend summer fun is a food festival for the ages, Smorgasburg is where you belong. But with over 50 food vendors to choose from, I'm here to make sure you know about Smorgasburg's most exciting offerings. Schnitzel is any kind of protein or meat that's pounded thinly, marinated, and fried. And I see you're serving it on pretzel bread. Yes. That makes me very happy. Yeah. The way people look at it, it's like, where have you been all my life? You know? <laughs> Bamberg is definitely our most popular sandwich. We use a Dijon mustard. On top here we have a little bit of pickled cucumbers, daikon, ginger, shallots. Look at this thing, it's just overflowing with delicious fried schnitzel right now. Oh wow, that looks like an audible crunch. Yep. Oh, that Dijon mustard. This is the stuff dreams are made of. Cheers. Yes, sir. Cheers. So you hear the name Bolivian Llama Party, you, you know you're in for something crazy. Right. Tell me, Sandwich de Cholo, what's it all about? Sandwich de Cholo is a triple pork sandwich. It's, it's basically a flavor bomb in your mouth, and you're getting the pulled pork, you're getting our home cured bacon, in addition to that pork belly cracklings to give it texture. Pork, bacon, and crackling. That's right. I've died and gone to pick heaven. I love it. <laughs> I'll meet you there. All right, sounds good, right? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> all right, here goes. Wow, that was a lot of flavor and texture happening right there. Right. And you really get that crunch from the pork skin too. That is so key. Flavor, texture, trip, right to Bolivia. Mm. So these are two types of chorizo sandwiches, really everywhere in Spain. In New York, you have so many Mexican places, you have a lot of South American, you have a lot of Caribbean. You don't get a lot of Spanish. This is the brunch sandwich. It's chorizo and arugula, and then membrillo, which is a quince paste, and manchego cheese, right. and a runny egg on top. You bite into it, it just, the egg just kind of drips over everything. Oh my god. You get the chorizo first. You know, the quince paste is nice and sweet. It balances out the spicy chorizo. I'm going in for one more. All right. This is truly Spanish food right here. Mm -hmm. And I want some more of this in my life. <laughs> no matter how much of Smorgasburg you've devoured by now, if you're like me, you got a little extra pocket of space left for dessert. Fortunately, you can bring some of it home with you, like these delicious donuts from Joe. Or, if you want to combat the heat with an icy cold treat, you can grab a popsicle at People's Pops. But for me, there's no better exclamation point on a hot day of eating in the sun than a delicious ice cream sandwich. This one right here is from The Good Batch. It's got vanilla ice cream, chocolate fudge, sea salt, and it's all between two oatmeal chocolate chunk cookies. Does it get any better than that? Oh yeah. There you have it, New Yorkers, a roundup of the most exciting offerings here at Smorgasburg. So we've had breakfast together, we've had lunch together, we've had dessert together. The only question left is, what's for dinner?